All right, time to find out why I'm receiving anonymous nav points. If I even do find out why. Guess I'll at least find out what anonymous nav point amounts to. The Mochi District. Oop. I gotta find my way in. Is it up top? Or is a side of this building open? It might be up top. There's a train up here. Oop. Here's the way in. Okay. Yeah, there needed to be a way to get inside this place. It was just kind of boxed in. A regular ass parking lot. I haven't seen one of these for a while. Looks like I'll have to go on foot. It's pretty far from a parking bay. I will stay here and play the waiting game. What's the waiting game? I guess how long it takes for me to get bored. Then, when I get bored, I start the game again. Right. I'll try to be quick. <laughs> no. Hello? Oh my god! Who are you? I haven't seen you here before. Come and speak to me. Why are you shouting so much? I'm not shouting! Not really. I could shout if you want. I just want to talk to you. Fine, just keep it down. Who are you? Oh my god! I'm Susie, and I love meeting new people. I'm so, so happy right now. I live for this. You live for talking to strangers? Uh, yes! You know introverts and extroverts. You're an introvert, right? There's no such thing. It's all just nonsense. Like star signs or blood types. But some people like to be more outgoing and meet new people. And some people like to stay home and read. Everybody likes those things at different times. That's just being alive. Well, I don't agree. You know extroverts. Well, I'm an extrovert. I was quiet and shy, but I got a neural mob that makes me super confident. Now, I can't stop meeting new people. That sounds awful. <laughs> I can't stop. Well, I mean, maybe I could help. I could... <laughs> I'm sorry, this is really dull. I need to talk to someone new. Uh, could you move along, please? Oh no. Is she just gonna keep having that conversation over and over again? <laughs> Just with different people, basically. Oh, it's upstairs. Whoops. Yeah, I've heard the introverts and extroverts basically don't exist. But I don't know. They're still useful words for stating a preference, I guess. I don't know. There are just people that are very outgoing and people that really, really aren't. So I can't help but think that that might still be... Saying that it's not real might kind of still be just kind of uselessly splitting hairs in a way that's unhelpful. It's the, since the words describe behavior types tied to personalities that are observable patterns that somebody displays over the course of, like, their whole life all the time. Because guess what? I'm super not outgoing and fun and want to meet people. Uh... Like, ever. It's not- it's not like, everyone does that sometimes, or whatever, like, I don't- I don't know, hard to disagree with that statement, Rania. That's a failure of imagination. Of other people's experiences. I believe I can get a punch card over here. I'm a weirdo that could pretty much just interact with like the same five people over and over again and be like, this is fine. Up even more? Hmm. This place is extremely vert. Take me, elevator. Is 
So thinking back on that thing, like it wasn't just that that one guy was committing suicide. It's that was a that was a line. What a goddamn nightmare. There were so many people waiting to do that. People that were, what, cursed because they once glimpsed the sky? So they're gonna take what's practically a space elevator just to see it one more time, and that's it. Not much else over here. That's how you know you got a world that damages people and doesn't seem to care. Purple flowers. And you gotta get yourself plants that are really, really good with large amounts of water in this place. Like, is this an unusual storm today? Because I'm not getting that vibe. At what point do you just resign yourself to being a permanent swamp person? Like, it's just, this is how I am. I'm just always wet. There is no other being. Would that aid with, like, your circadian rhythm or whatever for getting to sleep? When, like, when you get home, you dry yourself for the first time in an entire day. And then, like, that's, like, the ritual that leads up to you sleeping. There's like certain rituals that you can like get into the habit of that like that supposedly make your help your body recognize when it's time to sleep or something and when that's coming. And I wonder if that is affected by that. Is it down there? No, it's up. But this elevator go down. Yeah, I don't, I don't see an opening up there. On this side? So I think the up arrow is on... There it is. Is on the delivery. Bye! I said it before, but just... Ah. <laughs> Navigating this area and looking around, it just works so well in first person that it's weird thinking it ever wasn't. Bye. Yeah, seems safe. I am being stolen. Cadmus, oh. did you get bored? No, it is true. I am being stolen. Shit, really? Lock the doors. They are already inside. Tell them to get out. Threaten them. Pretend you have an anti-theft subroutine. Uh, they can't hear you. Why am I on speaker? Camus? I am taking off. I am frightened. Deactivate the Hava. Can't. <laughs> Hacked. Hava Automata eject custom personality Camus data drive. Eject? What if I fall into the ocean? Then you'll float, I think. You think? What if I get... Damn it! Eject Camus data drive now. Drive deactivated and ejected. Camus, Camus! Shit! 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 Think, Rania. Think. The drive. It should be registered to me. I can track it on my com. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Camus. They took my car. And they tried to take my dog. You can tell how much, how like very, very, very attached she is. Like that's, it's like her, the one person she has. Canvas, you better be on the floor over here. Uh, huh? Damn it, Camus, I'm sorry. I'm gonna try to dry you off, I guess. You can't talk to me right now. You probably can't even hear me. But if you can, I'm going to fix this. This isn't going to be a pleasant phone call. Control? Control, can you hear me? 
I read you, kid. Uh, you okay? Yeah. No. Look, I have some bad news. You lost the Hava? Yes. How did you... Uh, we track it. Listen, this one ain't on you, kid. Don't sweat it. it happens all the time. What? Seriously? <laughs> Hava jacking? Oh, yeah. Surprised it hasn't happened already. So, am I fired or not? Kid, we got insurance. You weren't hurt. But more important, you didn't lose a package. But what do I do without a Hava? I'm not gonna lie. We got a pretty generous repair-replace policy. I'm not saying we're happy when some slumganger steals a Hava that's two months over its predicted expiry date. Well, actually, I am gonna say it because it's true. Past its expiry date? How much of a junker was I driving? Hey, don't worry about it, kid. It got pinched before it fell out of the sky. <laughs> Best outcome for everyone. Not for me. Not for my... What the hell am I supposed to do now? Relax. You're real close to one of our suppliers. I'm sending a nav point for Grimm's Hava Mall. You ain't gonna find a Spire limousine from old Grimm, but any Hava he has will be better than what you were in before. Choose anything you want on us. Just tell Grim that Cloudpunk sent you. Control out. Hold on, Camus. I'll get you back as soon as I can. Well, that's distressing. Finding out the good news, which is that we had bad news we didn't know about, basically. Oh, this goes up. I need to go down. You go down? That's their policy? That's their strategy for maintaining their vehicles and so on, is they just don't repair them, and they don't maintain them, and they just hope that they get stolen before one of them falls out of the sky, and then they then the stolen one gets replaced. That's their approach. What a mess. And it's just finding out the hard way that I there's more risks than I, even I knew I was in. That might even be why some of the people vanished today. Hey, how you doing? You're looking good. Windy out there, that's just how your hair looks. Beautiful. Now, I got a brand new open top malichka for you. I know what you read about them, but it's all wrong. These models don't go on fire half as much as people say. We got customer reviews up in the high threes on this one. What I want to know from you is what are your reasons for not buying this hover? You got none, right? I'm gonna put you down for one, and I even got a discount for you, cause I love you people from out in the east. You know, with the music and that funny thing you do with the chanting. <laughs> Beautiful. You're gonna love this one, unless you want something more upmarket. In that case, I got you. I'm from Cloudpunk. You're supposed to give me whatever I want. Jeez, lady, why didn't you say? I was using my best pitch on you. Uh. Yeah, have a look around. Then when you decide, just hop in. Cloudpunk pays me either way. So if you'll excuse me, I got real customers to deal with. Yeah, thanks for all your help. Well, you were exhausting, weren't you? That one's purple. That one's a shoe. <laughs> And this one sucks. And this one's, uh, it looks like a Star Wars ship. This one's also a shoe, but yellow. That looks like a No Man's Sky ship. But the purple one looks like a station wagon. Well, it does look like a car. Which is kind of fun. I wonder, I wonder what they look like on the inside. That's really what matters to me more, because, uh... Now, uh, the purple lights will help me spot this one, which would be nice. But I wonder what they look like on the inside, because that's what I'm going to see the most. Is it even different? I don't know if I remember what it used to look like, either. I am your new Hava Automata. Please say your name, sir. Install new Automata custom personality. I have it on a data drive. That will be 1,500 limbs for activation. Charge it to Cloudpunk. How long will it take to... Ah! Camus, are you okay? Ah, uh, yes. What happened? I was stolen. We bailed you out on the data drive and I found you in a puddle. Then Cloudpunk sprung for a new Hava. It feels different, bigger. 
I can think more clearly. This is, yes, this is an improvement. Seems like it. I thought it would take a while to activate you. Did it feel like you were gone long? Everything was black and I was floating. It was quiet. Well, I'm glad you're back. Me too. Being bored is better than being stolen. Uh, I wanted to ask a question. What is it? What happened to Mom? You've been offline for a while, Camus. Mom isn't around anymore. Do you really want to know what happened? Will it make me sad? Yes. Being a car is fun, but I am excited to get a new frame. Do I have to be a dog again? Well, you don't have to be. You could be a cat. Oh, no. I thought you would say that. What about another animal? A bear or beep, beep. Why are you beeping? We are being called in by Cloudpunk for a HOVA overhaul. I thought Control said we could choose any HAVA we wanted. Are they checking up on us? I don't know. Beep. But we have a nav point and beep. The beeping is not stopping. Fine. Let's just get to the nav point. The beeping is not stopping. He's beeping at me. He wants to be a bear. Where am I going to put a bear? Don't you want to be able to fit in the in the vehicle so we can hang? Or do you want to be left behind at the apartment because you're a bear now? Didn't think that through, did you? Checkmate, dog. <laughs> it could be that I was on the ground for a while, but I think this immediately felt way faster, too. Ow, whoops. Oop, okay. Made a few mistakes back there. I don't think there's a health meter anywhere, or I haven't seen one. But once the glass cracked that one time, I was pretty sure I was in trouble. What's wrong? Camus controls are frozen, and the doors are locked. We can't even land. It hurts. They're holding us. It's... Your vehicle is currently being locked down by CorpSec Authority based on a data access violation. Please take your hand off your controls and deactivate your automata. I am fighting. Ouch. Uh, I can try to... It's no use, Camus. You'll just overheat your processor. Shut down for now. But... It'll be okay. Just go offline. Custom automata personality Camus now offline. Well, it was a trap. Great. Your vehicle will be set on an automatic course for the nearest CorpSec debriefing center. Your next of kin shall be notified. If you have any corporate connections or exacerbating finance options available, now would be the time to notify us. I've got no money and no friends here. Very well. You will now be... What the hell? Good to see you're still moving, Rania. I've bailed you out. I just used up some serious clock cycles on you today. My top hacker, Rubrik, just bought you some time. Those corpse set network protections were no match for his skills. You better move fast, though. If you can get to me in time, I might be able to clear out this mess for you. Why are you doing this? I've taken a liking to you. Now, hurry on up. You must be worried about how you can pay me back for this. But I got good news for you. I thought of a favor you can do for me already. That makes me suspicious that you set up the whole thing in the first place. Oop, shit. That makes me think that he set up the whole thing in the first place with me getting in trouble. Because otherwise, what, like, what, what are they after me for? Granted, being Cloudpunk seems basically criminal in itself, despite how busy they are. So maybe that's enough. Hmm, which part was the data access violation? I most recently helped deliver a painting and sent someone's belongings to their next of kin. Nope. Apparently I'm hitting the ground a bit here. Yep, 
Yeah, 3D driving would be pretty scary. I can't help but think the, uh... Driving near the bottom would be way more common because that's how car windows work. You tend to be able to see up more than any other direction. Well, forward and up. Other directions are much more questionable. Maybe we should take cameras with us every time we get out of the car. <laughs> if this is a reoccurring thing that's just gonna happen. I don't know how much I want to have to depend on the uh, eject feature. That sounds to me like a bad call. You brought me more juice? No, Lomo is expecting me. No juice, no jazz. I'm not here for the jazz. Unless you give me a reason you should get in, you ain't getting in. Does Lomo know you're dealing at the door? Uh, I'm not dealing. Just go in and keep your mouth shut. Mm hmm. Subtle. There's no way he's Where doing that for you? every person. I still don't feel good. Are you in danger? Can I help? Is it dangerous? Yes, it's dangerous. I'm about to meet the most feared criminal in this city, and I have to watch what I say. I need to look cool, so stop calling me on the comm and asking if it's dangerous. Try to keep calm. Uh, yes, I am calm. Very calm. Just wait for me. I'll sort this out as best I can. Then you should be unlocked and we can get out of here. Run. Good to see you. What's going on, Lomo? How did I get away from Corpsec? Why is more relevant to your current situation? You hacked Corpsec? Not personally. How can that be? Corpsec nets are way above the hard lines we can access down here. This might not be obvious when you look at your surroundings, but I'm a man with significant resources, Rainya. I can afford to purchase enough clock cycles from high-level mainframes to get work done when needed. Though, even I had enough second thoughts when I considered the costs involved to save you. But, of course, anything for a friend. I even put Rubric on the case. You've heard of him, of course? I guess. I have a lot of names. You'd be familiar with a few. Rubric will even be helping with the favor I mentioned. Do you remember the favor? What do you want? I need someone I can trust to take a package through a null gate. Why not just let Corpsec arrest me? Null gates scan a vehicle at the molecular level. That's the point. You can't smuggle anything through. You have the shape of the problem in your mind. But you don't see the details. A null gate can't be fooled, but the person operating it can. You don't need to know the technicalities, Rania. Suffice it to say, there are patterns which bring us to a higher state of consciousness. But there are also patterns which inhibit our thinking. These recurring, distracting patterns have been cropping up for the corpsec gatekeepers across all their media feeds for some time now. You hypnotize them? That's an old-fashioned way of looking at it. Let's just say their attention has been diluted, and they are more likely to see what we want them to see. I must be honest, Rania. The chances of you making it through are not 100%. What percent are they? About 42.5%. Before you despair, Rania, know this. If you make this delivery, I'll be in a position to pardon you of your crimes. A clean slate is tempting, no? And if I walk out of here? Oh, of course. I will completely understand. It is risky, I admit. But we will keep your vehicle. Scrap it for parts. You see, Corpsec are looking for it anyway. And though we won't tell Corpsec where to look for you, I'm afraid they won't struggle to find you. Your offense is not severe enough to send you to the colonies. But you won't work again. I'll find some way to make money. No doubt, Rania. I applaud your entrepreneurial spirit. But while you are looking for gainful employment, how long until the Dead Corp find you? How do you know about... Fine, I'll do it. Splendid. Now, about this package. They don't tell you what's in the package at Cloudpunk, do they? I'll tell you, though. 
if you ask. What am I delivering? You're delivering hope, Rania. That package contains a potential cure for Pallet 3.0. That's a computer virus, right? I've said all I can say. Get running, little rabbit. Well, if I get caught, I'm right back where I was before, except probably with a worse crime, so actually, I guess not. Not back where I was before. Concern. And what might happen to Camus if things go badly? So she came in here with baggage on top of the crimes that she's committing over the course of the game. Which shouldn't be surprising, I guess. When her neighbor was acting weird outside, even she thought that that might have been people she's watching out for. I am nervous. Are you nervous? I am feeling very nervous. I am very surprised you are not nervous right now. Please stop talking. I will stop talking about how nervous I am now, even though I really am very nervous. We'll be fine. The hacker guy, Rubrik, says the CorpSec officers won't even notice us. I didn't like him. Me neither, but we have to do this, Chemis. This guy Lomo seems to be a big deal. I don't think we can afford to let him down. Maybe even after we do this favor, he will ask for even more favors. Chemis, sometimes you can say something clever, but it doesn't make things better. Do you understand? No. <laughs> it's fine. Let's. <laughs> Let's get through the null gate, then we'll see what happens. Sometimes you can say something clever, but it doesn't make things better. Oh. Okay, let's just go over this. There we go. Well, this place seems threatening. I'm sure this will go great. That was a safe path to take. <laughs> Crashing again. Oop. Oop. Okay. I need to get my shit together. Yeah, I think this I think this car handles differently. I'm making all new mistakes. Beautiful. Hmm. So I passed the null gate in person? Not via vehicle. Punch card. Getting there. I'd like to come through. You know this road leads to the hollows. Uh, yeah, of course. Well, you're gonna have to give me a good reason for coming through here. What's your business? I'm meeting a friend. What's your friend's name? Banks. R Rob Banks. Why does Rob Banks live in the hollows? He doesn't live in the hollows. We're just meeting there. Why would you choose to meet in the hollows? We're musicians. Practice space is expensive, so we go out into the wasteland where we can play without disturbing anyone. What do you play? Flute. It's right here, see? Hmm. I've never seen one for real. It looks expensive. So can I go through, or...? Hmm. Well... I guess it should be fine. I'll tell the Nullgate operator to ignore the flute when we scan you. You know trade into and out of the hollows is forbidden, right? We'll let you off with the instrument, but you can't take anything else in there. That's all you got? No contraband? Only the flute, nothing else. Okay, drive on. We don't really know Rob Banks. No one does. He's fictional. Which instrument does he play? Whichever you like best, Camus. I like viola. No one likes viola. <laughs> Please stay for a moment, miss. We need to talk with you. Oh no, it has all gone wrong. Shush, Camus. Keep your cool. I have Senior Sector Officer Rio on my comm. He says you went through a security checkpoint earlier today. He wants to know why you're traveling around the city so much. Is that illegal? Look, miss, I just work the gates. But I have to tell you that attitude won't go down well with Officer Rio. Best just be up front and tell us. 
Do you work for an illicit memchip manufacturer, street racing team, an underworld gang named Block 4-0, or a delivery company like Cloudpunk? Please tell your boss I've never heard of any of them. I play private concerts and I'm very busy, so I travel around a lot. One moment, please. Yes, sir. Yes, private concerts. She has a flute. Yes, I saw it. I'm about to check the scan, sir, but you called me before I looked at it. I know it's my responsibility. All right, sir. So? I'm just going to check the scan, then you're clear to go. Um, I'm sure it will be clear. I'm in kind of a rush. I'm just going to check the scan, then you're clear to go. Officer? I'm just going to check the scan, then you're clear to go. Camus, I think Rubric's plan worked. What is wrong with him? I don't know. Let's go. Well, that's creepy. Well, the flute is working out as a cover at this you point, isn't it? The corpse man will be okay? I don't know, Camus. They said the effects would be temporary. What is the package we are delivering? Lomo said it's a cure for Pallid 3.0. I don't know what that is. Maybe a computer virus? I could search again. We got in enough trouble last time we did that, Camus. Every time I ask a question, I don't like the answer. And the asking always gets me in more trouble. Let's try to be a bit less curious. Oh, you can't stop me. <laughs> oh, it's creepy down here. Oh, this is a cool setting. 